I am going to make a photo studio for a doll using cardboard, scrapbook paper, card stock, printables from our blog, binder clips, toothpicks, bamboo skewers or wooden dowels, computer paper, craft paint, and glue. I start by cutting cardboard to make a large square. Place it on the folded edge of a piece of cardboard, trace it, cut on the lines drawn to make a corner room. However, I would like for the walls to fit on top of the base, so I'm going to cut the sides a little shorter. I double the cardboard on the base to give it strength, draw, cut it out to make a window. Cover the raw edges with paper, then cover with scrapbook paper. I chose to make it look like a brick wall with a wood floor and white trim. Then I covered the outside as well. To help hold the walls in place, I covered thin strips of cardboard with paper, then glued them around the edges to create a tray for the walls to lean against, making a one-room studio that can fit above our box room stores. Cut a bamboo skewer or skinny stick to the desired height, cut three smaller pieces, glue them evenly spaced around the bottom, glue on toothpicks or mini wooden dowels for support, paint it, Cut a square of black paper or cardstock, fold it on the diagonal in both directions. Cut on the fold, stopping just before the center point. On opposite sides, fold over the edge. Once all the sides have been folded over, glue the folded edge to the adjacent triangle. Trim the sides even, apply glue along the edge, then push it onto a piece of white paper. Trim off the excess paper, Glue it to the painted wooden dowels, making sure that one leg is pointed forward to balance the weight to make lights with diffusers. On paperboard, I draw the outline for a camera. Cut it out and use it as a pattern to trace more. Cut them out, making sure that when stacked together, they are thicker than a toothpick or wooden dowel. Trace the end of a toothpick in the center. Cut it out of a few of the center layers. Stack and glue them together with the cutouts on the inside. Sand the rough edges, cut strips of paper, roll it around a toothpick, apply glue to secure the paper, leaving a little left over. Glue the roll to the front, allowing the excess paper to go around the edge. Use glue to fill in any gaps. Glue a bead on top, roll another paper tube, adding layers of different widths. Glue it to the front, paint it, Glue three cut wooden dowels around a toothpick, paint it, glue on strips of black paper. I can use an acrylic jewel for a lens to make a camera that can fit on a tripod. Attach binder clips to the top wall to hold scrapbook paper for backdrops. Add a stool from a previous video, cut out the printables from our blog, glue the printable on the back of the camera, add a few pictures to the walls, and you're done. Happy crafting! How so? No more bad yearbook photos for me. Say cheese. What was I thinking with that hair? This year, I am going to have my photos professionally taken. We want to give a shout out to Just Cupcakes. What's up? Say cheese. Cheese.